Today we're taking a look at the Tucson Electronic Sway Control System. This system limits side-to-side -side movement of your trailer while towing. It corrects sway by activating your trailer's electric brakes. And it's more effective when compared to friction sway control systems because this gets ahead of sway before it really happens or before it becomes noticeable to the driver. It works with trailers with one to four axles or two to eight brake assemblies, and it's compatible with electric trailer brakes. Now this is designed to continuously monitor trailer angle, movement, speed, and other parameters for real-time braking calculations. The algorithm that it uses signals most effective braking response within milliseconds of detecting trailer sway. It independently applies left or right trailer brakes to counteract the movement and quickly correct trailer sway. And it automatically disables over rough terrain uh, to prevent unnecessary braking and the unit remains disabled until your rig is back on smooth ground. The system also enters a sleep mode after 30 minutes of inactivity to conserve trailer battery and then it will exit the sleep mode after power returns to the brake controller. Also, with this installed, it will not interfere with your brake controller, weight distribution system, or mechanical sway control. It features a fully sealed design. It's water-resistant construction, protects against road spray and the elements, and it's a one-time maintenance-free installation. The module, which is this box here, is designed to mount 5 to 10 feet behind your trailer hitch ball. Uh, and it's designed to mount along the trailer center line. So it needs to be securely fastened onto a vertical surface of a steel trailer frame member and be uh, uh, sure not to mount to surfaces that flex with the wind, such as plastic covers or plastic walls. Mounting hardware is included. Uh, keep in mind that your trailer must be equipped with a full-size 12-volt battery. It wires to each trailer brake for independent braking capabilities. Now you will need to provide a minimum of 14 gauge wiring to make your connections. Uh, so you'll need to provide the wiring to connect to these wires and then connect to the appropriate connection points. But each wire is color coded. So your white wire is your um, ground wire. Black wire is the basically your power wire. Uh, blue is for the electric brakes. Purple is for the left side brake assembly or driver side. And then pink is for the right side or passenger side brake assembly. Also, it comes with an LED light to provide system status for easy troubleshooting. This indicates normal operation, rough terrain or sleep mode, system power issues and more. The 10 foot cord uh, allows you to mount the LED light in an easy to see location on the front of your trailer. So that way you can, hopefully the idea with that is that you can just look back in your rear view mirror and get a good visual and see the status of the electronic sway control system. Now when it comes to the measurements, for what it is, it's a nice compact unit. It measures about five and three quarter inches long and that's from the outer edge of one flange to the outer edge of the other flange. Uh, about three and five eighths of an inch wide by two and one quarter inches tall or deep. That's going to do it for today's look at the Tucson Electronic Sway Control System.